Hello, my name is Maeve Coleman and I'm an Applications Engineer here at Maxim Integrated. Today I'm going to talk about how to set up a DS1922L iButton with OneWire Viewer software. This video can be accompanied by the application note 4373 OneWire Viewer and iButton Quick Start Guide. So first of all, you need four things in order to set up an iButton with the OneWire Viewer software. You need your PC or laptop to download the software. Second of all, you need an I button. This is the DS1922L Thermocron. It logs temperature data. Then you need a one wire adapter. We're using the DS9490R USB adapter. You need a one wire reader. We are using the 1402DR8 Blue Dot Receptor. Before downloading the OneWire Viewer software, you must ensure that you have Java installed on your laptop. It must be version 5, update 8 or higher. Firstly, we need to download the OneWire Viewer software onto our PC. Additional software drivers are also required to allow the PC to communicate with the adapter. Luckily for us, the OneWire Viewer and OneWire drivers are bundled together and available for free download on the Maxim website. The URL for the OneWire Drivers download page can be found in conjunction with this video or by simply typing OneWire Drivers into the search bar and following the link. From here, we will click, click to go to download page. We must now choose the relevant operating system and file for our PC. My computer is Windows 10 and 64-bit. Once we've selected those, we click download and the installation file will download automatically onto our computer. It is important to note at this point the adapter should not be connected to the PC yet, as this will interrupt the installation process. We can now open the installation file and follow the prompts. If you have a previous version of the OneWire drivers installed on your laptop, you will be prompted to remove it here also. It is important to make note of the file directory where the OneWire drivers will be installed. We can now plug in our adapter into our PC. For me, it's a USB adapter, the DS9490R. Once you have the adapter plugged in, you must follow the Microsoft Hardware Wizard instructions to complete the plug and play section of the installation. OK, we can now open the OneWire Viewer program. We can now plug in the reader and I button into the adapter. This is the DS1402DR8 and it has two blue dots which mean we can use two I buttons or one. When putting the I button into the blue dot receptor, you must hear an audible click to know that it's in place. We can now connect the RJ11 connector into the adapter. We have now set up the OneWire viewer. Here we can see the software has picked up the DS1922L that it has been connected and it's ready to use. We have now set up the DS1922L I button with the OneWire Viewer software. You can now talk to the I button to set up a mission or log data if necessary. For more information, see the application notes linked to this video. Thank you for watching.